Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Last night we got a ton of rain. I think it was like a little over four inches or something like that and it's now noticeably colder and noticeably more floody. This is the end of the parking lot behind Union Endicott High School. Some locals call it the pit. Uh, and the water is almost up to the curb of the parking lot here. So what I thought we would do is do a little uh, a little exploring, check out some of the conditions down here and over at Nanakoke, because I did see people posting uh, that the area of Nanakoke kind of down by the golf course is, is going underwater. So yeah, we'll go take a look. Thank you guys for all your support. If you want to join us over on Patreon, I'll put the links down below. I highly appreciate it. I love all you guys that... Uh, put in the effort to support what uh, goes on here, you know? So without further ado, let's jump into it. Uh, we'll throw the drone up, we'll take a look around and I uh, hope you guys enjoy it. Thanks a lot. All right, so we're down at Ty Cobb Stadium and as you can probably see, they have the field covered in sandbags. And then right here, is where the river walk would normally be through these leaves here. Usually there's like a little path you can cut down, but literally the entire river walk is underwater. There's the McKinley Avenue Bridge, Route 26. And literally right at the edge of the parking lot is the water. So if it crests, the field will probably be okay. Uh, but if it gets any higher, I think at least the parking lot here will be underwater shortly. Well, I probably should have just started down here because the playground at the Boys and Girls Club is like essentially inches away from going under or getting at least some water in it. And right here would have been another uh, entrance to get into the Twin River Greenway. As you can see the sign right down there. So yeah, the water, the water's getting close. In fact, this drain over here, there's water, there's a little bit of water from the river spilling over this bank and going into the storm drain. In fact, I bet if I move some of those leaves, it would start going right down in. So as you can see, we're down in West Endicott now and the uh, baseball fields are pretty well under. And uh, yeah, let's take a look from above and uh, see what we can see. I know on the other side of the river, uh, or the road I should say, was a pretty impressive view of the floods from what I could tell. So let's check it out. <laughs> 